Hey guys, we're the Sumer and I'm back with another Rome Total War commentary. This is a 2v2 with my friend Czech Chinese American. He is leading the Brutia and I'm leading the Carthaginians against the Seleucids and the Britons. So I'll give you a link to his channel in the description. Let's check out my army right here. I got a couple of Slingers and six heavily upgraded Sacred Band and two Pony Infantry on my flanks. They're kind of my wasteful unit. And I don't know why this is lagging so bad, but I guess that's okay. So I got two Sacred Band Cav. I didn't really go Cav heavy on this build. But he rushed, the, the, the Briton rushes up his Barbarian Cavalry Mercenaries. Good move. He pretty much got rid of my Skirmisher Force by doing that. I sort of forgot about them after that charge. And I didn't really have anything to chase him back. So this was kind of awkward. Like, I sent in my Slingers to kind of overwhelm them with numbers, but uh, these guys are meant for harassing skirmishers. So that didn't go too hot. Like, I, <laughs> I tried sending some cavalry, but I'm like, oh, screw it. I don't care about my Slingers. So he just chases those guys, like, all the way back there. All right, uh, these guys are heading up the hill. We're both fighting for the hill. He has his Slingers and Head Hurlers. And I decide to... Oh, looks like... Czech Chinese American sent up his Roman armored general to attack some of the slingers. And in order to get some revenge, I send my sacred band cav down there in a little while. Because I didn't like the British uh, barbarian cavalry destroying my slingers. But he sends these guys up with their... Why are they doing... No, those are slings. I thought those were swords for a second. But my sacred band are moving up. And this is going by really slowly because... I don't know, I guess I was retarded in this battle. But... Looks like he sends up his uh, British heavy chariots to uphill against these uh, Romans, and that wasn't a very good choice because it was going uphill, and Roman units are pretty disciplined, so it wasn't that good of a choice to do. But I want to get rid of his chariots as soon as possible. That was one of his good advantages that he had, so I sent some sacred band chasing. And where's that sacred band that's uh, going to absolutely pwn these dudes right here? Oh, it looks like I waited for uh, the chariots to get out of my way. So yeah, I set up my sacred band. I want to get rid of these chariots. Chariots don't like spears. Oh, here's that successful, awesome sacred band charge down the hill. Let's check it out. So I just charge in my cavalry down into his mass of skirmishers. And skirmishers don't like getting ran over by horses. But I try avoiding his chariots so my guys can do maximum damage without dying. So that looks pretty, <laughs> pretty full of mayhem, especially because of that downhill advantage. That's just crazy. And it looks like the Briton general finally died. So I'm just going crazy over here. And uh, the chariots... I don't know if they're killing their own men because they went crazy or something. But, yeah, pretty much destroyed all the slingers and everything. I send in some sacred band to try to help out and get rid of some chariots in the middle of it. But my cavalry pretty much messed up these dudes pretty badly. So that was very fun. And over here, it looks like the Celsa dude is trying to uh, skirmish with his cavalry. Uh, cataphracts don't make good skirmishers, guys, so don't just charge them in randomly. I don't think that works very well most of the time. So I pretty much defeated the Briton on my side, so now I can help out Czech Chinese American against the Seleucid assaults. So pretty soon I reform. Let's check out the battle over here. Looks like the infantry fight has started to engage, and it's a pretty even fight. Legionary cohorts versus upgraded Silver Shield pikemen. So pretty nice fight. Got some flanking action getting uh, flanked, I guess you could say. And he's throwing Pila into the sides. Pretty awesome move. Whoa. This looks scary. I don't know how legionary cohorts deal with it. But looks like Celsa dude's kind of trying to reinforce with his cavalry. This cab is pretty good, but <laughs> holy crap. Sending my cab, and those Pila just absolutely own those cavalry. And uh, I think Cav Pila were used to uh, stop cavalry charges back in the day, as well as lock up enemy shields so that they couldn't use them. So when they get into an engagement with the Romans, they are almost half naked, you could say. So I start hammer and anviling the uh, Celestid over here, help out Czech Chinese American a bit. But I'm pretty sure he would have this even if I didn't help. So he starts flanking with all of his dudes. Now that is exactly how you should beat a phalanx in this game. I hate urbans because if these were urbans, all you have to do is charge straight into the front of these freaking phalanxes and 
just absolutely pwn them all like with one freaking unit so good moves good flanking that's how roman army should kill a phalanx so we're just going in for some free kills this guy uh he admitted defeat good game to our opponents i was Tommy the fourth and my teammate check chinese american was gangsta caesar and these are the enemy armies good game to my opponents hope everyone had a nice day and like, comment, subscribe for more action.